Ok, so we are in Dumb Master as it is today, and we hit Super to enter Windows Picking State. The first thing is we have those squared corners, and let's open a few windows to see their placement on the background. So that's the appearance and sorting algorithm of the windows, and one thing to notice is that everything is arranged inside the background rectangle. Oh, kinda irrelevant, but do you see those up icons? On the first iteration the appearance effect was a very slow and annoying fading and scaling. But now everything happens almost faster than I, and believe me it is a huge huge improvement. Anyway, I'm just moving the windows around, and take notes of their position, scaling, and title labels, so you can compare later. That's everything from master, and if something isn't on master is like god, it doesn't even exist. So we have three pull requests. The first is on mutter, and it adds rounded corners capabilities on background. The second is on shell, and it basically provides the UI hooks for the rounded corners, plus it changes the alignment of the windows. So it should be something like on this image, and I will show it in a video in a bit. The third is like the second one, but on steroids. What it does, is that it's trying to make use of as much space as possible, even by drawing windows outside the background. Of course all those are based on the original GNOME 40 concept art, without meaning it's gonna happen 100%. Oh, and meanwhile, on this designs you can see the multi-monitor support. But back to the video main event, one thing to learn? Just because something looks pretty good on the paper, doesn't really mean it will be as good in real life too. So more likely these patches aren't that good, but perhaps with some tweaking will be better. In any case, what you see is what you get. And thank you for watching yet another super lazy video.